Singapore Botanic Gardens, a true oasis in a sea of skyscrapers in the heart of the city. The rustling leaves whisper tales of peace and serenity. It's not just a travel bucket list item, it's the perfect escape for the weary soul. Turn off your mobile notifications, reconnect with your core. If wanderlust had a center, this would be it. Visit, embrace tranquility, and tell me, isn't life astounding amidst the trees? Here are some things nature lovers seeking serenity have to look forward to at the Singapore Botanic Gardens. Let's talk about the Orchid Garden. World-famous orchids grow at the National Orchid Garden at the Singapore Botanic Gardens. It's home to a variety of orchid species and hybrids, including Singapore's national flower, the Vanda Miss Joaquim. Rainforest and Symphony Lake are also impressive. There's a lush rainforest area with walking paths where you can immerse yourself in nature. There's a swan-filled lake within this rainforest, Symphony Lake. Relax on the benches or take a stroll around the lake. The Ginger Garden has a bunch of gingers and heliconias. With shaded areas and comfortable spots to sit, it's a great place to enjoy a leisurely stroll. Swan Lake is another serene spot in the gardens, where visitors can see graceful swans and other waterfowl. There's a peaceful vibe around the lake, thanks to the lush greenery. Plants with medicinal properties are featured in the Healing Garden. Visitors can learn about the traditional uses of various plants in different cultures in this peaceful and educational space. There's the Bukit Timah Core, which is a remnant of the original rainforest that once covered Singapore. The area is left in its natural state, giving visitors a glimpse of the island's pre-urban landscape. There's a library and a museum at the Botany Center that provide information about plant history and diversity. There are a lot of events, concerts, and workshops at the gardens. Check out the schedule for any special events that might align with your visit. So there you have it, some reasons why you should go to the Singapore Botanic Gardens. In 2015, UNESCO named the gardens a World Heritage Site. The gardens are the first and only tropical botanic garden on the UNESCO World Heritage List. Which part of the video was your favorite? 